Come on, Mike, slow down. We are late. My stomach, Mike. I need a ginger ale. Uh, get a ginger ale and nothing else. Are those dogs fresh? For the man yesterday. Give me one. Yeah, there you go. They're gonna register. Stay right there. Mm-mm. That Skittles on the counter, Marcus? This ain't mine, Mike. Yes, it is. Mind your business with your cattle throwing nerve. Marcus, get in the car. He has a gun to my head. Wanna deal with him? You wanna deal with me? Call 911. Aren't you the police? Hey, Reggie, do you eat my snacks? No, sir. You need to get a job. I'm a U.S. Marine, sir. Well, then you need to deploy. Dad, look. We now have evidence that the late Captain Conrad Howard of Miami PD was working with drug cartels for years. Captain Howard is being framed. Let's go. What the hell? He's texting us from the other side. No, he's not, Marcus. If you're seeing this, I'm probably dead. Daddy! I don't know how high up this goes, but I don't trust anybody. You should be careful. They're being set up, detectives. We got two suspects, Lowry and Burnett. They're armed and dangerous. In five, four, three. No, we can't wait for Lowry. It's flammable. I don't care, scientists. Y'all are some terrible fugitives. I can feel like any rest in my mind. I need nasty mic. Bad boy. I got this. What you do, though? Are y'all still in our clothes? Just because we black, we still in your What? Look at your shirt. Why don't you sing us a little Reba song? Oh, uh -oh. Reba. Sing your favorite. Uh, I'm a woman. No, I'm a strong black woman. Yeah, because she's not black. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Mm -mm. That ain't no Reba song. It's from her mixtape. What you gonna do when they come for you? Have an awesome aquatical day. Jack, what am I tasting here? This is my take on the Langer's egg cream. A little bit of cinnamon. Oh, it's brilliant. Dear, should we get married? Uh, yeah. I mean, we could. Mr. Berriman, welcome back. What is it today? I have just finished a study of how we can make the bus schedule great. Reggie. <laughs> Mr. Berriman, I'm June Delray. Yeah? Executive Assistant to Councilman Steven Torinkowski. Steven Sturdy. He's a threat to our great city. Yeah. I need your help taking him down. Like undercover? Yes. Uh, I'm not really trying. Can I get back to you? I have to take this case. He's got a gun. A gun! We have got to get the women to safety. Okay, this is exactly what I'm talking this about. This is what she's saying. Look over here. I will look at it. Do you even know what it is I do? Honestly. Sometimes it's hard to feel different, to feel all alone. I started meditating to push away the blues, but now I feel them coming back. I'm not sure what to do. Honey, is there something you'd like to tell me? I'm climbing a tree into a canopy of lies, Diane. We don't know how far up the food chain this thing goes. Can I trust you? Steven Torinkowski is not what you think he is. Is he a lizard? Excuse me? I think you just need to figure some things out before you can hold space for someone I'm else. spacious! He's spacious for crying out loud. I'm spacious! Jack. You waited out in the deep end, and now you're drowning right before our eyes. I need you to be brave. I know it's dangerous, but I got myself into this. I gotta get myself out. What if I told you 
imaginary friends are real. And when their kids grow up, they're forgotten. Are any of them scary? Worse. Desperate. Question, why did these kids forget about us in the first place? Last week, I just started falling apart. <laughs> They're sucking the oxygen out of the room. Honestly, Doc, if this is how it's going to be, I'm just going to wheel myself back and plug in. Your hands clap. We've started the matchmaking agency to help ifs find new kids. Or we just disappear. Blue. <laughs> Happy place! Happy place! Oh, 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 copy and croissants! Copy and croissants! I can help you. How? I'm a kid. You are the chosen one. No, no. Let's not give her a complex. Good luck, short stack. It's all up to you. No pressure. Cock and dagger! Hope this works. Alright, let's find these ifs and kids. Keith! Kind of a kid creates an invisible if. I can find anyone. Anywhere! He got my mouth. Thanks for doing this. Don't look him in the eye. Which one? Yeah, that's gonna grow right back. Am I disappearing? No! Oh, all right, I'm not ready for this. I need to throw up. Or I need a snack. It's one of the two. Gross. We have to help them. Yes, we do. I'm not gonna ask you again. Put some pants on. You're freaking everyone out. How'd it go? Oh, oh my god. So this is make us partners. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, shall we? Keith! <laughs> and mom said too much candy isn't good for your tummy, but I said. Oh my god. Oh, wow. my eyes can taste it. I am so sorry. You don't taste that in your eyeballs? Happy birthday to you. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, it's been a challenging few years, for sure. But I'm happy. That is because of each and every one of you. I am the luckiest man alive. <laughs> Make a wish, buddy. Wilson? Who's asking? Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that supposed to be scary? Pegging isn't new for me, friendo, but it is for Disney. <sighs> Mr. Wilson, you appear to have soiled yourself while unconscious. I wasn't unconscious. Who are you? Why am I here? Walk with me. Wait. You are special. This is your chance to be a hero among heroes. I smell what you're stepping in, Sensei. Your little cinematic universe is about to change forever. I'm the Messiah. I... Marvel Jesus. Yeah, please. Oh, my God. God, I love this part. Don't just stand there, you ape. Give me a hand up. Nope, I'm actually okay. Thank you very much. Would you look at that? A ladder! Unfortunately, my design doesn't facilitate this type of... Well, destiny awaits. Legend has it that there's this massive treasure hidden in some secret vault. And if you
go hunting for it, you'd better take any help you can get. Because it's on the weirdest, most dangerous dumpster fire of a world in the universe. God, I hate this planet. What is that smell? Pisswash gully. Ew! Put the window up! I don't want to! Roll the window up! Roll the window up! It's Pete. It's Pete. Why do you think it's called piss wash? How did I get the name? It's in my mouth! Do you know how many people have died looking for this vault? We have something they don't, baby girl. Okay. What? Major issues. With your body parts. What did I tell you? Minimal no explosions. I said no explosions. Step aside, bitches. Ooh, mine's bigger. What are you doing? I needed a gun. So you asked for it. There's only one of you in the world, and you're special. Uh-oh. Kill them all. What's happening right now? I'm expelling the excess lead. I can't go if you're looking at me. Ooh, actually, scrap that. Oh, I can. I really can. Actually, it's helping. Are we really ready for this to finish? Ah, keep looking at me. Oh. Wait here, Junior. I'll be right back. Oh. Oh. You hungry, little guy? I'm gonna name you Garfield. Let's get it! Good morning. You deserve to be seen with somebody as bright as me. We're gonna need the big scale! Does she need to announce it to the whole office? Say when? Never, John. Bury me in cheese. Mm -hmm. Life here is pretty near perfect. Little did I know, it was all about to collapse. <laughs> Odie, I'm dreaming again. Slap me across the face. I think this is a case of mistaken identity. You must be looking for another gorgeous, lovable kitty cat. Big bag hunter with the <laughs> she got a big bag, drop it, drop it. Come on, Junior. <gasps> you. Huh? This is Vic, my father. Welcome back, Victor. <gasps> Listen, I need your help. Get them! <gasps> I haven't seen you for years, and when I do, you're on the run from a deranged cat. <laughs> we need to toughen you up. Hey, I know tough, Vic. <laughs> You've obviously never been in an olive garden that's run out of breadsticks. Follow my lead. <gasps> Oh, cheddar. Probably one of my top 26 favorite cheeses. Mm. My orange tabby and my dog are both missing. Your call is very important. There are 1,046 people ahead of you. <gasps> Drop them now! We have to go save my dad. Oh, that cat's a goner. You think you can battle these villains on your own? If I don't make it back, tell my story. Hey, little mama, yeah, you heard about me. Part of me ow, wants to help ow, him. Ow, no, ow, this ow, is how he learns. <laughs> no, please, no. Ow, it's so hot. Ow, it's really hurting. Ow, ow, ow. You saw nothing. This is it. The moment of truth.
Isn't it wonderful? Hey, Joe. Hey, Nicole. Miss, you're on fire. It's very original. No, I do not want to stop, drop, and roll with you. No, your book is on fire. <gasps> oh, my God. Alcohol and flames. They like each other. <laughs> Cold Davis. Kelly Jones. Public support for the moon mission is rock bottom. Every day, something is breaking. And we're dead. Again. Yeah, we're blowing up. The space program is a bloated mess. NASA needs a marketing specialist, and you are the very best. Excuse me? What are you doing? I tracked you down because I felt we had a connection. What? I'm joking. I work here now to sell the moon. NASA's not something that you sell with a jingle and a slogan. When I'm done, those men are going to be bigger than the Beatles. Who is that? For me, this is very personal. He's got my name. You told me that your guys don't do interviews, so I had to hire new guys. I'm here for the casting. Who's he? You. You're a juicy part. 60 missions in Korea. I flew 52 missions in Korea. I flew 52 missions in Korea. How's that? What? The whole world will be watching. We can't afford to lose to the Russians. We need to shoot backup version of the moon landing. You mean to fake it? No one can ever know what we're doing. I cannot accept that. They will shoot you. What is my budget? Oh, boy. I know a lot more about the moon than I know about you. Give me go, no go for launch. If you fake this mission, every single thing that we have sacrificed will have been for nothing. You know you couldn't have made it to the sea without me. Four, three, two, one. And... My Armstrong is a whiny little witch we have to recast. We should have gotten good work. This is Joy, coming to you live in Riley's mind. Make some noise! Sadness is in the house! It's anger! Let me at him! We gotta get our mouth guard, people! Fear! No, no! That's not ours! Disgust! Glad to have her on our team. Our little girl's growing up so fast. Ow. Sorry. It should be nothing but smooth sailing for... Hello! Ah! I'm anxiety. Where can I put my stuff? A new emotion! Oh, I'm sorry. We wanted to make such a good first impression. Uh, what do you mean, we? Uh, I'm envy. Oh, look at your hair. Oh, yeah, not happening. That's on we. On what? It's what you would call the boredom. What's your name, big fella? That's embarrassment. Welcome to headquarters, embarrassment. Mm. Oh, we're doing a fit. No. Oh, <gasps> nope. Going mm. high. Oh, mm. you got a real sweaty palm there, buddy. <laughs> Look, we all have a job to do. I plan for the future. You want to sit with us? These girls are so cool. Well, we can't let her know we're excited. Just... I got this. Uh, Joy, I'm just curious. Maybe um, I could. Thank you. Help. Not now. Yeah, yeah. Uh. <gasps> That's not gonna haunt us for the rest of our lives at all. Oh, you're feeling all right. I know change is scary. Let's do this. Hey, Riley. But we need new friends or we'll be totally alone in high school. Out with the old, in with the new. Riley's life requires more sophisticated emotions than all of you. <gasps> you can't just bottle us up. We are suppressed emotions. Oh, ah! Riley. Let Operation New Riley begin. You aren't packed yet? I'm the worst! <laughs> well, that's a preview of the next 10 years. Come on! Riley needs us. Have I ever steered you wrong before? Many times. <laughs> what is that? It's the sarcasm! Sarcasm? Boy, are we so lucky we ran into you guys! Boy, are we so lucky! Those guys are jerks. Wow. Those guys are jerks.
I'm your new roommate. Morris, alcoholic. Is Clint Eastwood gonna tell me to get off his lawn, bro? All right, all right. Okay. We're all here to get back. Well, I'm sorry. I don't think I've been more than two days without drinking in the last 15 years. You're here for a while. Do your chores and don't complain. It's pretty easy. Everything's gonna be okay. Welcome to the loony bin. You smell that? Probably from the weirdo before you. Used to keep piss and Ziploc bags under his bed and collect his own eyelashes. I'm gonna need you to contribute, be an asset, and teach these guys something. What's that? That's our 2015 softball championship trophy. We haven't taken it seriously in quite some time. You got this, baby. Go go booming. I keep running. Well, you focus on will grow. Do the men. Like the connections with these guys. Looking for something. And I am trying, guys. Dirty aliens. Something I don't know. <laughs> I felt that. I keep losing. The house is going up for auction in three weeks. I got nowhere else to go. You got 10 guys that need this place. 80 grand. Yeah. 80 grand. Pretty nice trophy for softball. We have to practice. Yeah. What are you hitting them? I'm pretending they're the rice balls. You need to pick out a team name. Backdoor sliders. <laughs> oh. Beaver pitch. Oh. Come together by the Skeetles. <laughs> oh. Jerseys. What the hell? <laughs> Are you serious, bro? Well, the C is pretty close to the D on the keyboard, so. Why are you really out here, Mars? I want to be sober. I want to be a rad dad to my little girl. What's up, girl? You got our uniform? I'm not wearing this. I like it. Let's do this. Get free here, get clean here. A whole new world cracks open. I know I'm a little fat now. I was very sought after underwear now. No. <laughs> I'm looking for the school. You're headed in the right direction. Everybody. You will be very popular here, Miss Rabia. The kids are good, in their way. Mr. Zebra. It's pronounced Zebra. This is an extreme weather advisory. What is he talking about? He's gorgeous. Boy, I wish I had a magazine. Maybe you could fill her in on the English syllabi. We start with 1984. You know why? Because Big Brother is watching. Because it's 1983. Oh, dad. Which means next year is I 1984. Get it. That's why 1984. So you drink, you like to drink, you like to get drunk. Any night after eight, you go. Wear your least comfortable bra. What is the population of this town? A little of 800 and who cares? You're back in high school now, and everyone's looking at you through homecoming glasses. My husband, he's working on his doctorate. I'm just getting out of his hair. You just move to another town and pretend to be someone you're not? Vance was a quarterback. Quarterback? Is that why everyone treats you like a celebrity around here? That man will be coming over to join us in three, two. He just left. When is someone going to come over to my world instead of me running all over creation to accommodate everyone else? Hey! I wanted you to know that I've been disappointed. People only realize they didn't need someone else to invent their happiness. I'll pay you back in beer. At you, Gus? We'll see about that. When? So, what are you going to do? What, like long term? For breakfast.
I just want a house. I want a place I can call home, Nick. That's the American dream. Four walls, a patch of grass, a place to write my novel. What are you doing here? Get yourself a starter condo, like reasonable people do who have no money. Two hundred forty thousand with live-in. What does that mean? The house is immaculate. It's worth every penny of the asking price. Her husband passed away years ago. They never had any children. Live there until she croaks, and I get the whole house. It's almost too good to be true. Want me to help you make the hot water colder? You must be Astrid. Did you hurt yourself? I fell. Oh! Uh... Did you break anything? Because if you break anything, you pay for it. Well, it's nice to meet you. She has offspring. This is one of my kids. I have a contested will in my future. I'm gonna sue you. And everyone involved with you. You exhaust me. You are an angel, Phil. I want to feel your light. I'll evict you before the week's out. Mm. I've been having a series of very bad days. What if she lives another 20 years? Do you wish death upon her? Not tomorrow. You saved my life. No, no, no. Every time I see the light, I see your face. Just because I'm standing over you backlit. What kind of moron buys a house under such circumstances? <laughs> Are you crying? I'm sorry. Stanicki, what up, man? Are you serious? Have someone call me when you get out of surgery, all right? You should drive out there. Ricky's been there for you guys your whole lives. The devil's in the details, my friend. <laughs> it worked. Atlantic City, here we come. What we got? Ricky's cancer's back. Why does it have to be cancer? Won't everybody get worried? Yeah. And that's going to take us right into the World Series. To Ricky Stenicki. The best friend we never had. Mm. My baby's going to be born six weeks early. I was born six weeks early. Oh, <laughs> I want to know where the hell you guys were tonight. We called every hospital and there was no record of a Ricky Stanicki. You know, all we did was tell one lie. Hundreds and hundreds of times over many, many years. If the truth does come out, my marriage is over. What if we hire an actor to play Stanicki? Rock hard rod. X-rated rock and roll impersonator. I do a whole act. Wall to wall, top to bottom, jizz jams. Thanks for coming out tonight, ladies and gentlemen. So horny to be here. This is a really bad idea. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. I've been cold turkey in the booze. Ricky Stanicki's in the program, remember? Oh, Rod. It's not what you think it is. It's just piss. I'm a hyper every time, not my muff. I want you to admit that Ricky Stanicki does not exist. Hey, my spooka! Stanicki! Yes! This is Ted Summerhays, my boss. Ted, nice to meet you. Digging the suit and the seedlings, man. The seedlings. The hair plugs, they're new, right? This is my hair. We're gonna lose our jobs. That my best friend. She a real bad on a dance floor. Epic night, am I right, guys? Lucky she throw it out and come back in. That's my best friend. I was really taken with your friend Stanicki. He's got brass balls on him, that guy. That's why I hired him. That's awesome. You just said... What did you say? Just say it one more time. We can't let him out of our sight. Not only did I miss the birth of my son, but I let some porno Peter Frampton impersonator snip his... And we're done. Stanicki, you are unbelievable. Show's over, Rod. It's Ricky. Ricky Stanicki isn't real. My job sucked. I had no friends. But now I have all those things. Oh, are you a fraud, sir? What is she talking about? Best friends. That's my best friend. We gotta get rid of him. Every time he tries to make a point, it's like he's smoking invisible dogs. Dear God, it's true. To support. Now it looks like I'm cupping the balls. When someone tells a story, they create an entire world. And usually, 
the characters stay there. But there are legends of characters so real. With the crayon, anything is possible. That they step right into this world. Let's see how this baby works in the real world. Terrifying. That's terror. That's terrifying. Do you know what brought you to life? It's what your crayon is made of. The most mysterious, powerful, extraordinary stuff on earth. Wax. Pure imagination. Okay, I am getting really good at this. What were you thinking? Oh, no, honestly, I, I don't do a lot of thinking. True. My man Ezra flying without a net so that he could order himself a... Ice tea, please. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor who first told me my son was autistic. Could have saved us both a lot of time if he just said the truth. Autistic kids don't give up. They don't. They want me to put him in a special needs school. Jenna knows I'm broke. She knows you're still not over her. The man your age shouldn't be living with his father. He led 20 kids onto Washington Street. Your son has been a danger to himself. He's not dangerous. He's a challenge. Nobody wants to do the work. Now I see where the dangerous behavior comes from. Shut up! You want to do something for your son? You get yourself to L.A. Jimmy Kimmel wants to book you. What? They're not going to fly you. Is that going to be a problem? Uh, no. Hey, hey, what do you do? Ezra, get in the car. I need to get him away from here. Todd, I'm taking the car. I'm taking him aside, hey. Pop Pop. All I ever wanted was just to protect our boy. Well, I'm protecting him now. Give your Uncle Nicky a hug, huh? Come on. Come here. Hey, hey, where are you going, Ken? You know, the word autism comes from the Greek, in your own world. I don't want him in his own world. I want him in this world. That kid is the one thing that I can't get wrong. Just look him in the eye. Like looking a horse in the eye, it's like sharing your soul. Where the hell are you? Taking a little time off with this. Not a good time to take off, Max. You're fighting for something. You might have to suffer consequences, but it's worth it because you did it. Because you love your kid. A dad's job is to take his son down the field. And if he gets tackled, Gosh. all that dad wants is for that kid to pick up the ball and to take it the rest of the way. talk to you about Sophie. She's the one. Check out this bling. What? Marrying Sophie to get Canadian citizenship. It's brilliant. No, Dad. I've been asked to interview for the executive chef position at the Chateau Frontenac in Quebec City. Quebec City, Canada? Yeah. Well, further north. And look at this place. 400 years of history. They're from New York, you're a Rangers fan? Oh, I actually don't follow hockey. <coughs> I love figure skating. Figure skating? The costumes, dazzling. So you're the famous Ruby Collins. And you must be Gordon. I've never got your family name. What the f Yeah, she told me she'd been with women before, but this is her ex. Good work. She lied to you. She didn't lie. She was protecting my feelings. Pop the question before she switches teams again. <laughs> oh, my day was great. I tutored your brother. Je connais un gars. Pour mille piastres. Il peut smash. 
Good legs. No like Don Yardin. I slaughtered a little baby lamb with your father. Oh, wow. Oh, and I also found out that you and Ruby used to be lovers. I brought you here because of your talent, not because of our history. I have the night off. Are you serious? Living in the city with my family really would be amazing. It feels like I can't do anything right, unlike Ruby, who can do absolutely no wrong. When a woman like that sets her sights on something, she always gets what she wants. Are you shooting blanks, Gordo? I got a fish! I love your daughter, and I'm not giving up that easy. I am the best at car chasers! At this point, you probably all think I killed Mammy. Uh, uh, I didn't come in. I didn't come in. What's happening? I know, I'm just, it's so beautiful. America, sit in. This is easy. These juke shops are banging. How was a field trip, boys? <laughs> yeah, we gotta hand feed the giraffe. Yeah, the sucker was eating right out of her palm. You made this? How old are you guys? 16. 14. You idiots are gonna end up on the side of a frickin' milk carton. I'm grounded. No more running free range all summer. I've got one week to find a legit job before my mom goes full tilt DEF CON. We need to bag some summer jobs. You think you can hook us up? You can ask if they need an extra hand. With what? That thing. Snack Shack. I think they bid it out at the city council meeting. I want to pitch you an idea. Okay. You bid $2,000 on the Snack Shack at the swimming pool. Actually, we bid three. <laughs> it's a total shithole. Yeah. But it's our shithole. Let's get to work. We need this fucker spick and span in case some hell inspector comes stepping around. Moment of truth. Goddamn, fellas. Not shit. We're gonna be rolling in so much fucking dough this summer. Here you go. Hey, can you call me a diet coke? Thanks. You know that shit? So what's your name? Are you playing with me? What are you doing? So I fuck on it with ketchup. Charging 75 cents more. That's fucking genius, dude. Right There's been a pattern with you two. An escalation. Oh. Oh. A very dangerous escalation. It's open season, <gasps> limp dicks. You never know when, you never know where. That's piss, ain't it? You're unbelievable. This is fucking epic, dude. I just want to this summer. Feel me? One little advice, homie. Make a move. Any move. Give me a fucked up, kid. Cool. You're unbelievable. Nice wheels, douchebag. I'd walk through the ocean. I'd walk through the ocean floor. I'd run through the desert. This year, your years are growing old. I'm going to break up with you. Why? You're 为什么一直不出去找工作呀？不是你擅长跟人交流。你说你这些年你为这家做啥贡献？活活不干，给你找工作工作不去，你想干啥呀？人活着嘛，总得拼一次，不是吗？其实我站在拳台上，啥都没想，就想你了。我想参加拳击比赛。啊、哦，要减肥？不是，我要参加拳击比赛。啊，走！啊，走！加油！加油！加油！这条件能打拳吗？走，右，出拳，走，右，出拳。站起来，站起来，左手很有劲啊！一、二，接下来要上场的拳手。这是他职业生涯的第一场正式比赛。
，让我们有请顾乐莹。其实，我挺喜欢拳击的。两个人打成那样，最后还能抱在一起，我以为想得到拥抱，只有对人好才行呢。所以现在就不在乎别人的看法了。看心情。I think you can do anything. I think you could do that, but I also think that maybe there's a world where you put all of this creativity just towards a stable job or something more consistent with actual money. Sorry, what? I'm Rudy. Isabella. Isabella, prazer. Prazer. Mom. What? For as long as I can remember, every day regular sounds I turn into rhythm. She's different. She's beautiful. She's smart. She's funny. Oh, tell me more. But now Haley, I think, wants to wants to get back together. Tell me less. But honestly, I don't think you actually know what you want. I'm figuring it out. Well, I know what I want. Just tell me. Tell me what it is. Are you okay? No. I feel like everyone's pulling me in different directions, including my mom. I don't think Brazilian girls are most beautiful. Uh. Yeah. What? 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 What did you just say? Uh, I I didn't say anything. Oh, just give me a second. What? I'm sorry. Let me no, just talk. Judy, I have to Can I come on? Where did Dad get all this stuff anyway? Hey, Dad. No, that was <clears throat> Father. Hey. I'm gonna miss you, Dad. No filming. Mom. Just another day at home with Lydia. Have you thought about where you're applying? I'm not gonna apply. Last year of high school, huh? That's exciting. She's a little sensitive because she hasn't decided yet what she wants I'm to do. I'm right here, Mom. Oh. You need to do something to grow. You spent the last year on par. I'm actually making a movie. What? Yeah. Dad was a screenwriter, and I never even knew. I'm making Dad's script. Space Chronicles. I'm getting that NYU scholarship. Do you even know how to make a movie? Do I? Hmm. I have no idea how to make a movie. I need help, you know, like an assistant. This should be exciting. Auditions, the energy, it's the theater. I am reading for Gilmore. Gal for first day of auditions. It was terrible. I find your lack of faith disturbing. Can you remind me again exactly how you're paying for your little movie? Come buy some pity cookies. Hello,、Better、we are、know. making a movie. <laughs> Action! Do we need to take a break? Boy, wait, wait. My skirt's missing the next page. Me too. Um. My grades are slipping. Okay, I'm exhausted. I know you've been through so much, and well, I. I don't want your pity. There comes a moment where you think this is impossible. Direct engagement with the camera can add a lot. And the costumes dazzle, and you think to yourself, "My God, I participated in something magical." You're gonna get your happy ending, promise. I'm sorry. This is a movie cliche, unoriginal. The mystery of the obscene little Hampton letters is causing widespread distress across the nation. Edith Swan takes it up the snow, and she loves it more than Christmas Day. Only words matter. She sucks ten <clears throat> a week minimum. Holy heavens! In the end, I think it's just jealousy. 
Rose Gooding, you are writing these wicked little letters to Edith Swan. Why would I send a letter when I can just say it? I'll get you in the box, sir! She's heinous. You want <gasps> in the nose, you old beetle. Beetle? Right. <laughs> You're charging her. What's the evidence? Let me out, you work! Similarities in the language. I've got a daughter at home. Why would I risk it all? In prison, Rose may find some kindred spirits. In prison? No, no, not the murderers or the rapists. I'm thinking more the drunks and the queers, maybe. Just trying to find a bright side. I believe we may be charging an innocent. If you meddle in my case, these will be on your wrists. She makes me wonder. I think you've been set up, Rose. Is there anyone who'd want to do such a thing? Have you got a pen and paper? I like you, Rose. I hate her! <laughs> you don't like the idea of me leaving this house, do you? You are a serial liar. No. We'll find who wrote these letters. I notice they say foxy ass a lot. Nobody swears like that. What would you say? You look like Queen Victoria Shunt. <gasps> you daft old f- oh.